Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your mid-September general reading. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Let's get started. Um, last, well the last reading it was about the person from the past. I don't know, I think it's a water sign or something. I can't keep up. Um, I don't know if you should trust this person. You don't know either, let's see. We do a five card advice spread. The first card is Libra right where you are. Are you on the correct path? Is Libra on the correct path? The main obstacle. It's helping you. And then how can progress be made? All right bottom of the deck the page of wands some of you it's like you're dealing with either a younger fire sign of course someone outside of your ethnic group or ethnic makeup or someone who is a little flashy this could be your child or a child a young adult child that you're dealing with let's see this is you right where you are Libra. two of cups nice some of you are deep in love or you want to be in love you want that Two of Cups type of relationship with someone else. Or you have it. We'll see. Are you in your correct path? The, oh, the chariot. Says that you're moving forward. You've made progress. This is victory and getting in control of the light and the dark, the good and the bad. Just getting in control of life situations being thrown at you. Being in control and doing what's what's best for you. You know, the chariot is a it's the cancer card. This is about self. Cancer can be it's a, a very selfish sign. You know, not in a bad sense, but they you know, they're they know how to maneuver for self. You know, Libra's taking on some of that energy obstacle is it is taking that risk maybe with that person I was talking about or or in that situation that business that new job that uh, new home whatever taking that risk starting over that's what because this is the zero card so it's like jumping into something new a new development that you don't know you know how it's going to pan out That's the obstacle. What's helping you? The Six of Pentacles. Um, you may be, you may have gotten a payout. Um, there may be some good Samaritan helping you. There might be um, this may be the fact that you help others in your past or your or recently. Or now you 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 pour into something else or someone else so all of that good measure is coming back to you that's good this was helping you how can progress be made Wow the ace of God. I think this is like the best reading ever um, let spirit fill you with of course love light let it radiate from you, but also be filled with, um, you'll get your answers from spirit, you know, because this is a new start by way of uh, new love, new friendship, but it's blessed by the heavens, meaning that what you do with this new start is, is on you, it's, we still have free will. There's new insight here for you. Some of you have been doing some research too, maybe into you know, the esoteric, the other, the other realm, the other side. Um, net, let new love start for you. You might be getting a message from someone, maybe younger than you, coming up as a fire sign. Let's see what this is about. Who is 
the two of cups with Libra. What is the two of cups with? Ooh, it's because you did the self reflection here. Could be with a Virgo. You're letting something culminate for you because you 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 really looked at self. And you said, how can I improve? Why? Yep. You looked at self. You did the work. And now what you you want in regards to love relationship is here for you. Put these back. Come back. That's nice. The, the hermit and the magician. This, this okay. We've got the Wheel of Fortune and the Six of Swords. Some of you are moving. The physical move. Um, this is destined to happen. New doors open for you within this move. And this could also be a, a mental, emotional move away from what was turbulent. Uh, this also could... This new way of, of looking at something, new insight, brings you good fortune, money. What is the six of pentacles? Help it. Wow, Libra, come on. Yep, three of pentacles. You're right. Um, because you have helped in the past, you have been charitable or giving. It's coming, you're getting recognition for that, and it's coming back to you by way of maybe new contracts, new work, a uh, new offer. You're getting the spotlight is on you. People see what you're doing, how you're doing it. It's, it's more clientele. What's the Ace of Cups? Some of you do spirit work, you know, and um, you're getting some real good traction within that in regards to business ace of cups what's the ace of cups the star card wow you could be dealing with an aquarius person or there was like healing allow spirit to that's what i was talking allow spirit to kind of fill you up with that positivity that healing that radiance so that wish fulfillment can happen healing can happen restoration um, can happen for you okay it looks like because you you have been working really hard towards something a new business a new home this is new home too and there's a move you've been working like tremendously hard toward um, you put a lot of money into something a lot of time and a lot of effort. What is this fool? What's the fool card? For, my gosh, Libra. The Knight of Swords. Yeah, this is an abrupt change. Home move. Job move. It's 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 fast acting. And it's it's like you have yeah, it's it completely changes and alters your life. And also you could be dealing with a Scorpio, Cancer. Aquarius, Virgo. I mean, we got our, the whole gang is here. Um, you may be frightful about um, a move in a different direction with maybe a Scorpio person. The chariot. What's the chariot? The moon. Definitely Cancer. These are like, this is how you're looking at money and you're looking at your situation. There's like hidden fears, emotions that creep up probably at night when you're sleeping. You think about, you can see if it change your mindset around money labor. You can't have negative thoughts around money and maybe selfish thoughts of hoarding um, money and fighting over it 
You know, this could be in regards to a partner, a Capricorn is significant. Someone thinks that you, you are hoarding money, you're, you're keeping money, um, they feel left out, or vice versa, you feel this way. And it's all fear-based and lack of confidence. You think somebody's after your money or somebody stole from you or took from you? It's all fear based. Okay, Libra. I mean, pretty much it's, it's all good. And then there's you. What's just and fair is coming to you. Karmically, what is due to you is coming to you. If you felt like things were off balance, off key for you, in the recent past or right now it's all straightening itself out it looks really really good for you we're 11 minutes um don't operate in fear operate in the highest vibration and that is love because wish fulfillment and what you have worked so hard for is coming to you the desires of your heart what you want is coming to you or has come the offer blessed by the heavens ace of pentacle something that's stable solid that you can build upon is here family changes you know some of you um may be on the outs with family members there's family changes someone's moving in and out in or out there could be a home move we see that in the cards in addition to the family subtraction you know support you have that or you are that to someone else uh, changing your mind we don't read these in the reverse changing your mind yeah i think okay healing from the past we got that and parental care bottom of the deck keep the faith retirement is sticking out so I'm going to, I'll touch on that also. Keep the faith that things will, will sh are shifting for you. The justice card is here. You're showing up in your own reading. Parental care. Uh, so you need to either go backward and check out your mom or your dad. Or you need to evaluate your parental skills with your own children or lack of whatever there might be young adult children that you have who are taking um, toll on a situation you might be on the outs with somebody or they're on the outs with you Change your mind, changing your mind. You had your mind made up about somebody because it was all fear based and it was all might even have been jealousy. But something is coming to light or has come to light and now it's making you change your mind. You need to heal from the past. Whatever happened in the past, move on. Some of you had people take advantage of you. Keep the faith that things will turn around. Retirement. Now, this could talk about actual retirement. Uh, you know, withdrawing from the workforce. You no longer are working. Or this could talk about the change and the shift in um, how you make your money, your income, a, a career move or a career change. Also, could talk about the number or the, yeah, the number of hours you put into making money. It could shift into part-time. You're retiring from full-time work. You may be doing part-time work because now your lifestyle allows you to do such. You're retiring an old way of making money. Okay. Let's get some angel answers in here. Let's close out. All right. One more.
Okay. Bottom of the deck with romance. Ooh, did you see that? The Ace of Ace of Cups, Two of Cups, the Fool. Nice. My Libra Moon. I'm gonna go ahead and take this reading. Let go. Your, your grasp has has been so tight and firm. And I'm hearing the, your grasp uh, in regards to how you're thinking about something or someone. Let go. Let go of the, that fear and that jealousy or um, the competition of. Let go. Live and let go. Because there's success here for you. You've worked hard for it and it's here for you. Look for a sign. Look for a sign that it's coming together for you. Healing from the past and romance. Okay, Libra, it looks really, really good for you. Um, taking that leap of faith, maybe with someone from the past. You get everybody showed up. So hell, you you tell me. Um, it looks good. It looks good because firstly, you've done the work on you. You've manifested this in your life. There might have been complete change, a shift in energy for the other person. So now they're coming back anew. Make sure you do your research and your homework that they are coming back anew. Um, if you haven't personally done the work on you, then we know that this reading is not for you. Start with you and then let the universe bring you whatever it is or whomever it is supposed to be in your life. So don't take this reading if you know that you still act the same way june bug is still acting the same way y'all doing june bug things no let it go do some work with yourself first and then you can uh, have success in romance i'm gonna take this card and pray about that i need that anyway uh, Libra, if you feel like this reading uh, resonated for you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Oh, let me let you, I'm going to do a yes or no spread for Libra. The yes or no spread is on sale for $10. You can go over to the website, book the yes or no spread. You can also now um, choose to talk to me. You can buy minutes with L over at the website. Um, purchase minutes with me, call the number. But before you call, send an email or screenshot to the phone number of your receipt. Call and we can talk about whatever you want to talk about, all right? Um, let's see. Make sure that I am available before you purchase. Make sure that day is available, okay? If it's not, you have to wait until the next day I'm available. But you can purchase minutes with L anytime and use them any anytime. You don't have to use them same days. But let's see, well, should Libra take the leap of faith? The leap of faith with this person. Should Libra take this leap of faith? Should Libra be the fool and take the leap of faith? Should Libra be the fool and take the leap of faith? Okay, first one on the top. Hmm. Ooh, the chariot in reverse. Ooh, ace of pentacles in reverse. Nine of pentacles upright. Eight of pentacles. For, so for some of you, this says no. Take some time out for self. Work on self, because upright that would be, I've mastered me and myself. I'm having victory for self. In the reverse, it's no. Take time for self. Look what comes when you do take time for self. The Ace of Pentacles on the upright. You can solidify a relationship, business, whatever. But some solid energy comes in. Right now, you, you need to Nine of Pentacles work on self. Continue to Eight of Pentacles. Master your craft. Work on yourself. Do the inner work. Um, it could also be outer work. Some of you might need to get on an exercise plan. I don't know. You let me know. But... It says work on self first and then move forward. Look what happens when you move forward. You have victory. You have two victorious cards. So 
for some of you work on self for some of you you've already done the work and this is what the culmination of it is all right and the fruition of it take care libra all of my information is below website go to the website go to the website send me an email um and i can direct you also i know that i'm praying for you pray for me as well take care bye